some of our most popular t-shirts. She's a fashion designer but also a public figure who speaks out on many important issues. Her name is Catherine Hamnett. Give her a big round of applause. Thank you very much. Hi everybody. Um, it's great to see so many people here today and to hear that this is the start of a new, a new movement to take control of our democracy, to take control of the way that our money is spent. Now, marches are great and petitions are fantastic and it's amazing to see so many people here. But like the huge Stop the War in 2003, the guys over there and the guys over there will take absolutely no notice of this. We need to up our act. We need to campaign now with teeth. The only thing that politicians take any notice of is something that affects their ability to get elected. Jeremy Corbyn said that. Somebody else said, Politi politicians are a vested interest group only in politics to get re-elected. Well, we've got a golden moment now. We've got seven, was it seven, eight months to the next election. If everybody at this march wrote to their MP and said, I'm not going to vote for you next time, if we don't get out of Iraq now, and if write also to the leaders of political parties and say, we're not voting for you unless you get out of Iraq now. Enough is our enough. This is our money. We've got a right to decide how it's spent, and we don't want it spent like this. I'm doing some campaigning t-shirts for Kitsko, for instance. Um, Camilla Batmangili, who is doing the most incredible work, looking after 45,000 children who have fallen out of the social security net, who are suffering the most appalling neglect, thanks to her, they say. She needs £16 million pounds by Christmas, or she'll be reduced to going back to just getting food parcels. And these ourselves are spending our money on a war we don't want, the people who don't want it. Write your MP, tell them you won't vote for them next time. Write to these guys over there, write to Ed Miliband and anybody else who's lying around. And if there's nobody else to vote for, maybe we should start a new political body right now based on direct democracy in Switzerland, direct democracy in Estonia. Look it up. I looked it up. What's wrong with it? Switzerland, not been involved in a major war since 1847. No national debt, no crime, no unemployment. What's wrong with that? Why can't we take that and transfer it here? It would mean MPs lose their power, they become IT administrators, building referendums in their constituency to write for that place over there. We can nationalise and turn into a nice luxury hotel. We don't need it. We need to have our voices heard now. Write your MP, tell you what about them next time. Out, get out of Iraq.